Welcome back everyone to another episode of Tavern Master. I'm Grojan and today we are going to try and work on... I don't actually know. I start that way quite a lot, don't I? I never know what we're going to do until we get there. But we have got another quest and... It says level up any employee. That should happen pretty soon. Reach 140 guests per day. That won't happen today because we're doing an event which is going to get us 30 people in. Um, prepare roast the fish. We need to do another 15 of them and add four more decorations. So that shouldn't take us too long. We have gained 300 coins as a reward for our little event. Our next research, we are doing this one. We need to serve another 29 rare people. So that shouldn't do too bad because we're getting 30 in today. So that might move along a little bit. Um, apart from that, we are building up our prestige. We need another rug. So we're going to grab one of them first. We're going to go for the blue one again and stick it in that little gap. And then we need to have a look for some more decorations. What can we actually afford? Oh, games. We can't do none. Garden, we can't do any. Kitchen, nothing. Special, we've got our picture. <gasps> That's where we lost our money before. We got rid of the picture, didn't we? Okay, so that's what we're going to do is put that back on there. Look at that 1945 reputation now. We can actually only have one out of one of these. And the same with the adventurous table. We can have four music podiums. Maybe that's... We could have one on each floor. I don't know how many floors we can have. I don't know at all. But that's okay. I would like to upgrade our bar at some point. But we do have new drinks, don't we? We can do... Let's get a milk barrel first. I don't know why we're going to be selling milk in the pub. But we are. We are. And we're going to fill that up for 150. Right, next time we get one. Oh, look at the way that's gone up on the second shelf. That's kind of cool. I like that. We need to top up our wine. Oh, the wine must have been from that event that we just done. I think it was. I think it was. That's kind of good. We made a little bit of money. Right. Reach 143 guests per day. That's done. Oh, we have nearly unlocked an elite waitress. Or Marion. Marion? Not a name I'm too aware of. Right. Can we do anything with our adventurers? We can. We can get some more cheese, maybe. That's going to cost 173 do we want to do that? I don't think we do just yet. Because I want to go and buy another barrel. And I want to get cider. Let's get some cider. And we're going to top you up for 218. Doesn't go all the way up, but it's not bad. And then when we get our next 700, we'll buy the mead barrel. And things will be good. We have just finished a research. Plus 21 guests today. Now, the next one. We might get the kitchen items level 2. For that kitchen. These all need stuff that we can't do just yet. That's a light bulb that we can't click on. Oh, because we've got to have gold, people. Right, we're going to start this one then. Kitchen items level 2. We lost 878 quid that day. That's okay. Oh, we got another thief. And our guard is fighting them off. See you later. We... Be nice if you gained a little bit of money for doing that. Okay, so we've got a new quest. Reach four stars with any food. Okay, so that one might take us a little bit of time. We're still okay for our food ingredients there. And let's have a little look at our menu. Regular food. We haven't got anything except for bread on more than two stars. So that's going to take a little bit of a while. Our vegetable soup is nearly, nearly done. Average 0.81 equals a 3% chance for rare. Oh... So, oh, look at that. We have got a golden customer in. We got a golden customer in. And that must be because of our food chance. That's kind of good. So, where did it say this? A 0% chance for these royal royals. We can get royalty in our pub. That would be so good. Right, we are back in the green in our money. So, we need a little bit of stuff. Our drinks are going down really fast today. And our tables are full. We need to expand our tables and just get this pub filled out. Really big. Okay, so we've got to complete a quest there. And it was a success. So we got nine cheese. And I think we might be able to create another event. Which is going to be wine tasting. We get another 30 guests. That one would be good for 50. But we need a little bit more prestige for that one. So that'll do. We have got enough money now to buy our final mead barrel. 700. We haven't got much money to put stuff in it. 
So we're just going to have to hope that it lasts a little bit. Okay. That's okay. It should make our people quite happy. Our people are waiting quite a long time for some stuff. So let's have a little look at hiring some staff. We need another waitress. She can carry eight drinks at a time. So let's grab Ada. And we could probably do with another one as well. It's one tip for every, uh, every drink served. Yeah, we're going to get Rosalind as well. Hey, okay. lots of staff now. Lots of staff. We have had a menu item. Level up. We can do level one tomato soup. End of the day, we made a 600 million profit, which is pretty good. Our stock is still looking okay. Our stock is still looking okay. So we make tomato soup and we got no tomatoes. So I wondered if that comes under fruit. It might do. Start the next day. What are we doing? We only got minus 89 now. So that's not actually too bad. Our adventurers are set at the table. Did we not have another quest on the go? We didn't. These are all leveling up now. Which must be good for us. We probably want to do some more strawberries. Guessing we got to do them in order a little bit. Do like easy ones when they level up. Go up to the next one and the next one. Right, we have got another item on the menu leveled up. Vegetable soup. Right, we have got a rare customer in here as well. Our people are still waiting a little bit too long for stuff. Do we need any extra members of staff? Our roasted fish has leveled up to number three. And it's telling us that Matilda has leveled up. So we're going to give her a speed while not carrying. Is that it? Just the one person? Yes. Right, we have got 700 coins now. And what I would like to buy is another decoration. And I want another one of you. Oh, we can't fit him in anymore. Doesn't matter. We could fit him in there, though. Just like that. That'll do. How much? Oh, hang on. Level up any employee. We've got our two there. And we've unlocked Marion, the elite waitress. Okay, so. Let's go to this. And Matilda. Oh, we just got given it. And she can level up already. Let's see. Speed while carrying. She's quite slow at that one. We'll give it it anyway. Okay, so. Life is good. Our little checkout counter outside. Checkout counter. Look at all the people. So many. Right, we are going to need to top up some of this. 720 fills everything to the top. We lost a bit of money today, but that's okay. All the waitresses are cleaning up a little bit. One of them stands on the little marker we put on the floor. The rest waited at the bar. <laughs> Strange. Okay, so we have got another event today. We are on minus 710. But our adventure is still coming for a little trip. All our guests have been saved and we gained 300 coins. Which is half to our loss. Okay, on our menu, we have leveled up our cheese to one star. So we have 45 coins in our events for this, which is really good. Uh, green pea stew. I don't think we've got enough stuff for that one. Maybe. I'm not sure. Strawberry cake. Right, we have got another quest. We've got refill 400 litres of any drink. We're going to be doing that pretty soon. Because our drinks are getting a little bit low. I'm just waiting for a bit of money so that we can do it all at once. There are 614 we need. Let's have a little look at what events we can do next. And how much they're going to cost. This one. Two, two. Oh, we've got enough money to do this. We've got enough things to do this one. Special events. What's that say? Work anniversary. We're going to do that one in a couple of days on Sunday. Okay, 700. What do we need to do this? 7 cent. Oh, we had enough to do everything. Right, so for our next event, I don't know what we need, but it doesn't matter yet. Refill 400 litres of any drink. There we go. One, two, three points. The next one is seven points. Gets us 400 coins. Bert is unhappy and might quit tomorrow. Okay, so Bert, what's wrong with you? You're ready to level up, but you're probably not happy. Let's give you 60 coins as wages. Does that just make it any better? I think so. So our event is over. We've still got our little table of adventurers who I might send out on a little job today. Let's give them 
let's see if we can get some mushrooms. Yes, we should get these mushrooms nicely. So 133 coins to start, and we'll get 15 mushrooms. It's a 100% chance to complete it, so I think we might be fine. Let's start the next day. Our people are coming in. Our waitresses are waiting at the table outside. It looks like she was serving nobody then. Our stuff is looking great for our stock. Our drinks are looking fine too. We could do with topping the wine up a little bit, but we got no money left. And we need to start working on some decorations. Tomorrow, I believe. Is it tomorrow? We have got another little job, another little event coming in. And it's going to be the workplace anniversary, was it? I don't know. Prepare roaster fish. We're getting there with our roaster fish. We need two more decorations and we've got to raise the staff happiness. We could do that by giving them all pay rises. But our chefs are working hard in the kitchen, stirring soups and preparing all kinds of stuff. And our tables are completely full again. So we might have to... We might have to get more tables next before we work on more prestige. But Bert has leveled up. We are going to give him that one to carry six drinks. There we go. So that should speed that up a little bit. Hopefully our waitresses can keep up on the tables now because we've got so many of them. Right, we've got enough people to get some tables. Uh, 70... Trying to figure out which is going to be the best way. That looks like the cheapest way to get more prestige because that's like, what, two and a half tables for 200. So maybe we should save up a little bit and get one there and one there and then grab a load of benches. Oh... Rather than benches, maybe we can get some more comfortable seats, like... I don't really like these, even though they give you quite a bit of reputation, but... Stuff like that, or this could be better. Better than benches, I guess. But let's save up our money and grab it. So our people are starting to wait a little bit longer. They're putting their hands up and no one's coming. So if we click on hire, it's saying that we don't really need anyone else yet. We'll see how it goes. Okay, so we have nearly got enough now. We've got 1,400. We should be able to buy our next table right about now. So, we put you about there. So that can fit 10 people on it, whereas that can fit 8 on. So this is even better as well anyway. So, um, seats. What seats do we want? We haven't got no money. We've got one coin left. <laughs> we are getting... We've got a nice table and no one to sit at it. Right, there we go. We've got enough money for one seat. Let's pick. What do we want? Hey, that gives us more. Do we really want seats like this? We can't afford any seats. We're just going to have to wait. <laughs> We're just going to have to wait. Okay, so our menu. We have upgraded the leek soup to level 1. Okay, so we made a loss of 26 coins today, but that's not actually that bad because we bought that giant table. Our adventurers are coming in. How did our little trip go? That's not what I was clicking on. Okay, so we completed it and we got 15 mushrooms. Nice. So we're at minus 431. We need to level some stuff up. Our stuff over there is still looking good and our food stock is still looking decent. Right, have we got any events planned? We do. We got the work anniversary tomorrow. Right, we have got a little bit of money. What chair did we want to do first? 400. I kind of feel like we should be getting these ones, right? Even though they look soft. One, two. Right, we can... Oh, that's got three seats on each one. We might have to just do... That does two, four, six, eight, ten. Yeah, so that's how we're going to have to play this. We're going to have to put you there. Right, we can't buy another one just yet. But let's move this across a little bit, because we're going to have to. We'll stick you... There. Okay. So what do we need for the next bench? 150. Oh, we can actually afford you. And you. We might have to move all this over a little bit when the time comes, but I think it's going to be okay. Maybe I should have done them long ways. We'll think. Of, we'll have a little think. Right, what have we leveled up? Our cherry cake has gone up to level 3 as well now. And our staff, Isaac, has leveled up. Here we go. We're going to give you a speed of 5. I can't wait to see our next little event. 
Hey, we can afford the last bench. Well, we, I say last bench. We need a few, don't we? Get one there. One there. Ah, overlapping. One there. And one there. Right, that's enough for 10 people. You know what? We can keep it that way because we can put another one long ways on this side. 228 customers in a day. That's loads. All right, we have finished our research on kitchen items level two. So next up, it's going to be, does that say hotel? Wow. Okay, so we can't do that because we need gold people. It's going to have to be. Here's how the hotel works once you unlock it. Build a room with a door and a window. Step two, go to the shop. Step three, buy a bed, a wardrobe and a decoration. Step four, wait for the customers to come in the evening. You know what? We have actually got a little gap that we can do a hotel for, but we cannot click research because we've got to do this one before we do. And we probably got to do that one as well. So we'll start this. Everything else before it is done. Okay. So start the next day. 2,700 reputation. Let's see what it costs to go for our next one. With the one that gives us the gold, people. 3,700. So we need another 1,000 reputation. Okay, so... We can do the work anniversary. We're not too far away from the executioner's meetup. So maybe that's what we do next. 400 coins for all the stuff that we've done. All right, let's see our stock levels. Let's top you up for 500. And do we need to 649? We'll just wait until we can do all the drinks and then we'll start working on our decorations, I guess. Here we go. Let's top our drinks up. Perfect. Now. Let's see, what can we upgrade? Decorations. What's this? A bookshelf? Ah, oh, this just goes on the wall. Let's put... How much are they? 75 gives us 70 reputation. Two. One there. And one there. Okay. And is there anything else we can put on the wall in between? I want one of them fires. Right. We can have cups. Oh, that can go above the bookshelf. Oh, we all... It says it overlaps. What? That's no good. <laughs> Never mind. Right. This one can go on the wall in the kitchen. We don't have enough money for this one. That's okay. But we've just raised our rep a little tiny bit. Okay, let's see if we can get that next one back. Decorations. Oops. And I want to get one of these little shields. Where can we put you? Put it behind the bar. What's that? A curtain for the windows? We don't have enough money for that one. Oh, that's only 75 quid and we don't have enough for it. We'll get that soon. Right. Own eight decorations. Oh, we are so close to that 400 coins. Our fish is nearly done. Food with four stars nearly done. But our staff happiness is down a little bit. What if we... Let's have a little check at our staff, right? Who's not happy? Bert. Right, 71. Makes you happy. 31 makes you happy. And there we go. Staff happiness is sorted. And we just made 400 coins. We got 1,200 now. Right, let's go and get a curtain for our windows. And what does that give us? 50 rep. We do one there, one there, one there. Do we really want to put these in the kitchen? I don't know if we do. Right, decorations. We got our little coat of arms thing. We could grab some pictures. Do we really want them? What is this? A little coat hook. We could put you just there. So we need another 500. We have got enough money to keep buying stuff. A couple of plants on the wall. Right, where would the Grab one there. I'm going to put it next to a pillar. Okay, one there. Right, that's good. 3,555. 
What do the decorations give us nice points? What is this? A globe? Why would we want a globe in the middle of the pub? I don't know, but we're going to stick it right there. One more thing. Let's grab a picture of 500 and we'll stick you. I do that right about there. Can we fit another one on? We could. But we've got no more money. Right, 3,800. Let's go to our little events tab. And on our next event, we are going to do... Oh, we haven't got enough peas. We are going to do the Executioner's Meetup. You need to unlock the new recipe. Mushroom soup. Well, that's not good. Okay, so we're not doing that. Where do we unlock mushroom soup? Is that going to be in the quests? I wonder if that's it. It doesn't actually say. But we need peas. We're going to have to get some of these. Oops. We're going to have to get some of these guys out to get some mushrooms. Not mushrooms. Peas. That one. It's going to cost us 150. So hopefully tomorrow we can get that done. We've got another thief. Or oh, wannabe thief trying to get into our pub. Chased away again. Okay, so. Let's see what our new quests are. Save only main courses. What? Why would we want to do that? Level up any employee. I don't actually know how we sell only main courses for the whole day. But it shouldn't be. To oh, a fire broke out. Focus on the fire. It's a table. <laughs> okay, so you. There. You. There. You. There. And you. There. Resume game. Come on, let's get this fire out before it does too much damage. All our people are running. Some of the furniture burns in the fire. Do you want to replace it for 50? Well, we've done quite well there. We put the fire out really quick. We've leveled up an employee. We're coming up to the new recipe. And staff have leveled up Lauren. We are going to let her carry an extra drink. Up to five. What were we looking to do? The Adventurers Guild. Right, there's no one here. Available Adventurers. So we want to do this one. But I don't know whether we've got enough people for this. Oh, we do. And it costs us 138, but we need the peas. So we're going to have to. Looks like we're going to have to keep doing the Adventurers things a lot more often as well. But we want to get a new table. But we still need 50 and 100 quid for that one. <gasps> I just noticed something. We can paint our furniture. I don't know why we want to, but we can. I wonder if we could paint over that, or if it's just going to be the wood. I'm not actually sure. Hey, okay, our money's building up okay, but I've got a feeling that we're going to need to start buying some of this stuff soon. Oh, we've got 1,500 quid. Do we want to buy the table? Straight away? Might not be the worst idea. How far away can we have it? About there, maybe? That looks okay. Right, we have lost 261 quid for the day, which is not too bad. Next day begins. All our staff are having a little mother's meeting in the kitchen. Have we got someone waiting outside already? We do. Or it's a rare customer standing outside using our takeaway. Okay. Missions, prepare roast of fish 25 times, that is done. Oh, so close. Have an average food of 1.19, we're at 1.14, so that is quite close. And our staff, we have got Abram has leveled up. Let's give him a little bit more speed. There we go. Right, can we send anyone out to get more peas? 145. There we go. And if tomorrow happens... Before that one comes back, then we'll send another group out for it. We need to go and send some out for strawberries too. Maybe we should do some wine tasting. That we'll use 10 of our cheese though. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. So we need to buy some benches. Seats. This one. This one. This one. This one. There we go. Another 10 customers. 
can fit in. So I think our next one's going to come down this way. And then we're going to fit one in that little gap there. Our prestige has gone up to 4,240 though. So let's have a little look. What our next events require. So the battle celebration victory. We've got enough for that. We have almost got enough for the pirate gathering. But we haven't got the recipe. Smoked ham. What's this one? Mushroom soup. We do have the green pre shoe. Alright, let's check our drinks. We're getting a little bit low. We're going to just top all of it up. And then we might as well do the same for our food as well. Just before we run into any trouble with it. Okay, how busy it is outside. Made a 64 quid profit today. Not so bad. Not so bad. This is looking good. Okay, so we will start the next day. So, our new quest, we have got to save 50 rare customers by organising events. Now, I think we do have an event today, which is going to give us 50. We're getting 300 coins, which is really good because we needed it. Right, let's see if we can grab another pack of peas. Oh, we got no money. We got no money. Oh, one is complete though. There we go. Once that is done, we will plan an event to get some of these gold people in. This one. 3750. Yeah, we got enough for it. We got 10 steak. We got... Nearly got the 10 peas. Okay, we have got enough to get our next Adventurer's Guild going. And we're going to do that. And I think we should easily do the 100%. One day on that one. So we're going to get another 8. Which is going to be plenty for our next event. Our money is flying. Our money is flying. When we get 1500, I might grab one more table to go there. I think on our research, what are we doing next? Oh, we're doing this. We need to save some gold, people. I don't know what this is. Is that like a light bulb? I've got no idea. <laughs> I've got no idea. Right, we can't do any of them until... Until we get these gold people in. It's, our money is coming along well. I don't think we're going to have enough for another table before the end of the day. That gives us 10. That gives two, four, six, eight. This doesn't actually save us any space. It doesn't. Like right, 10 o'clock and the pub is emptied out. We could potentially upgrade to our next one of these. It adds 24 seconds onto our guests. Does this mean that they're happier to wait more time, maybe? Let's get the best one. No. Let's get the trio. Upgrade one at a time. Right, we made a grand today. We've done really well. But we lost the grand by the time we opened up. <laughs> That's all right. All the people are piling in. All the people are piling in. Let's see. On our adventurers thing, we've got that. We've got our four things. Let's see if we can organise our next event then. We can. We can do a battle victory celebration. But well, let's organise that one. That's going to give us... A thousand coins as a reward as well, which is massive. So let's see. Save only main courses for the whole day. Well, we accidentally done that one. And we got a new recipe. I've got no idea what the recipe is. But let's go and have a little look on our menu. Regular food. I'm still none the wiser. Oh, it might be in our events food. Here we go. Green pea stew, maybe? Or mushroom soup. We can possibly do the event now, or we can. We can do the execution as meetup now. That'll give us 500 rewards as well. Shall we do that one too? Shall we do that one too? Is it worth it? Why not? Why not? So we got two events planned. We have leveled up our fish steak up to level two. And our pub is booming. Our pub is booming. Oh no, we've ran out of something. Wine. We drank all the wine. Refill. And shall we refill our food as well? It's only 282. We might still make enough to get our next bench before the day is over. But I think... What have we got? We need cheese. We need strawberries. Let's do a cheese one first. 217. Okay. We've got no more adventurers left for that one. That's okay. 
Right, we are going to have enough money for our table. Grab one of these. We'll stick you right about there. And then we just need some money for benches. We might fit another one in that gap. Or just one down this way, maybe. Okay, so, have an average food of 1.19. That's done. And we have got... Redford has leveled up to level 8. So we're going to up his speed. Get these meals out a little bit faster. He lost 815, so that's not, not horrendous. So, next day... We've got our adventurers coming in. We're on minus 739. We did complete this and got some more peas. And we need strawberries, but we can't start another one just yet. Wait, what have we got there? We got another quest. Reach 289 guests per day. Oh, we're on 283, so we're so close. We fill 400 litres of any drink. Right, so this could be enough. 209 strawberries there we go we send you out and i think we can up uh, we can afford a seat just one right there some props are overlapping not anymore we've got loads of money let's go and buy our the rest of our benches there we go that we can fit loads more people in 291 hey look at that we've done that one 289 oh we're one short of our money say 50 rare customers we're on 40 39 so we're getting there four stars with any food that's still taking a while and refill the drinks can we do the drinks now we might as well right we have leveled up bert he's gonna go up there, we're going to get him to carry eight drinks. Bert, this is Bert, right? Yeah, Bert is our barman. He's doing quite well. Right, another quest. Save 50 people. Done. And we got our 450 coins. So next, we get a picture for the harvest. Some new floor tiles. Oh, look at that. We could get an elite chef. An elite chef. That'd be so good. So we're going to do this last day before we finish off of the day. So spend more than three grand in a day. Well, we haven't got that much yet. Oh, we've done a thousand up to now. Earn more than three grand in a day. Okay. If we do one more quest, then that'll happen. Oh, this is all our gold, people. And we just earned a thousand. Right. Things are going well. Let's upgrade all them. And upgrade all them. What was our quest to? Not that one. It's okay, so we still need to do more drinks. We're not that close yet. We need to spend a lot of more money. Right, let's get our little adventurers guild out. And I think we can do... Oh, we've got our cheese done. I think we can do... We don't need these two just yet. Right, we need... Strawberries are coming. We've got 11 cheese, 15 of them. Let's grab another cheese. Here we go. Okay, let's see. We need to top up some more of our drinks. Some of them are going down quick, quite quick, like the beer and the ale, which you would expect. Let's top you up. We've got 2,000 coins now, which is massive. And we don't even really need to do that. We'll do the meat anyway. Right, we've got 4,000 prestige. Let's see what we can buy. Oh, hang on. We've got a quest done. Air more than 3,000 in a day. Oh, we finished the research too. Right, before we do anything else, what I want to do is buy one more bench. Right, we're going to put you there. And then we'll do seats. See, we've got to spend a lot of money today. So this could be our little rich folk area. Oh, we don't have enough money. Doesn't matter, because we have finished another quest. Spend 3,000 in a day. There we go. We have unlocked the harvest picture. Right, let's see for our decorations. Uh, decorations special we got a free harvest picture right where do we want to stick you stick you on that wall there 5,000 prestige wow okay so that is done we can add a new floor we can research this but I don't know what it is 
researchers. Okay. So I think things have gone pretty well. Our pub is looking huge right now. We can extend out this way a little bit. We could do maybe the hotel and a set of stairs going up from that side. But overall, overall, things are looking really, really good. Over there, we have refilled 400 litres of any drink. So that's added that one too. And we're going to get three new quests tomorrow. But that is where we are going to finish off. Everyone, thank you so much for watching. Really does mean a lot. Hope you are enjoying the game so far. If you're new to the channel, if you are enjoying it, please hit that subscribe button. If you enjoy the episodes, hit the like button and drop some comments down below. Let us know what you think. I want to say a massive thank you to all the people who signed up on the Patreon and joined as members. It really does mean a lot. Thank you so much. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye.